I was starting to think that the description of our channel should be how to DIY on a budget with zero skill, patience, or common sense. I should have taped that. This was something I made. I bought the peel and stick. It's not working. I want it to really work. I got this frosted glass. I'm gonna cover the innards. Let's tape. Like nobody's business. It's time wasting. It just takes forever. I'm done. Ah! Clean the spray. We're gonna try this. It's Rust-Oleum frosted glass finish, and it is semi-transparent. Let's see if it works. What in the world? All right. That means that I should have waited a few more minutes in between. Then I put my finger right there, and you'll see that fingerprint. Awesome. Let's just wait that out. See what happens. It's been about an hour. I should have cleaned the other side of this before. Remember how it had that little stain there? I think I might do one more coat and hope for the best here, because I see a little bit of weirdness. I'm gonna do one more coat. Well, it's been a few hours. And I love it. I love it. Look at that. Okay, there's a couple of streaks over there. And I see what I could have done different. It's crazy, man. So, you know what I could do right now is do a polyurethane spray on top of it. And that'll keep it waterproof. I like it. I don't mind it at all. All right, this is the step I have. Let me do a quick one. And they did say to go at an angle. If I go at an angle, it shouldn't give me those little streaks, right? All right, let's go ahead and let that dry. Well, it's day two and it's beautiful. I'm gonna clean the other side of this so I can see what it looks like without all the muck. Okay, that's much better. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I've been wanting to do this for a really long time. Oh, I'm just, uh, this is the hard part. I don't know how this material works, so is this gonna come off clean? Yeah, it is. It's gonna come off clean. That is awesome. All right, let me undo all of this. Where is the color? I'm losing my life here. Okay, here it is. So, let's see if this works now. It just needed a primer, right? Is that even dry yet? Nope, it's still sticky. But I'm so curious. I'm gonna wait for that to dry. Here's the deal with this stuff. You have to do it within an hour of putting on the first coat if you're gonna put on more coats. And I don't know what's gonna stick. If I leave it like that, is it gonna stay like that? Like, texture-wise? So a part of me wants to go in and just see. I'm going to. Is the texture there? Yeah, I'm gonna need a different brush, but at least I know it's going to stick. This is the only thing I could find at the moment. Yeah. All right, let me just leave it alone for right now and let it dry. It's been about an hour. Yeah, that's good. I want my brush back. I think my brush is good now. Like, it's not bad. It's what I expected. So, look, I was in a pinch. For future reference, I probably wouldn't have used this appliance epoxy as a base, but I didn't have any 321 primer, which is what I would have used, so I used that instead. Seems to be working so far. Might be a happy accident. Might be a horrible accident, but that's how I learned. I'm a learn by doing kind of girl. I'm gonna wait for this to dry, then I'm gonna come back. So far, let's just take a look at it from afar in the grand scheme of the room, and I love it. Love it so far. Day two, let's look at it. Not bad. It's fine. It's on. All right, let me paint on top of this. <laughs> it's just, I'm, I'm learning. I'm living, I'm learning. I'm starting to think that the description of our channel should be how to DIY on a budget with zero skill, patience, or common sense. I should have taped that, but I did it. But you know what? I was gonna start, and then I was like, man, I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna keep going. Why would I just do a little? I think it looks gorgeous. I love it, actually. So that's the first layer. It's not bad. There's a little lip, makes it easy. I'll do another layer when I do the other layer of the bathroom. Just get it all done. I like it. It looks good. Look, there's a lot of mess ups. There's always a lot of mess ups, but that's how I learn. I'm really good at cleaning things up. All you need is like alcohol and a razor. Legit. 
legit. Sometimes, not the razor. Sometimes not the alcohol. Sometimes it's just water, whatever. It's been a week. I had to clean up. I had to walk away. I cleaned up. Woohoo! I had to walk away to come back into the bathroom. I, I'm, I'm better now. I'm better. This didn't work out. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. It just didn't work out. I need to strip it. Guess what works really good on that? This does. It was the epoxy that I put on there, the appliance epoxy, that didn't work. Okay. I want to move back into my closet. I want to shower back in here. Ah, all right, I'm gonna go strip all this paint off and repaint it. Mm. Okay, okay, I'm gonna tape it. Now's not the time to be lazy with taping. <laughs> okay, I did the inside too. And while I wait for that to work its magic, why can't I just paint these with that hammered spray? I'm gonna do a hack too, because I don't want a breaking bad in here. What if I just made a hole? <sighs> it's genius, but <laughs> tape it on. If this works, I do not have to take any of the door handles off. Please let this work. Send me some time. Yes. Yes! It's gonna work. This is the most genius hack I have ever come up with. That's so much easier. That is awesome. All right, now that I'm here, I am going to do this. But now that I see what's happening here and I don't have a circuit I think I'm just gonna put a cardboard up and try the rest of them here too. Whoop, 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 whoop. Man, acoustics are nice. This is gonna work for me. I really like that a lot. And this paint worked back here because I didn't put any epoxy. I still have to peel it off from the front and that'll happen later. This is so much easier, so I decided to do that too. It is getting saucy in here. Protect it up, can't find my smaller mask. This'll do. So I got to thinking, how can I make it even easier than that? Let's try some heavy duty riddles wrap because I got it and I can put it around. Let's tape. Okay, this genius idea was way better than that genius idea. That took forever, it was crinkly. This one was one, uh, Whatever. Oh my gosh, I love it. Both sides done. Inside done. That part done. Extra piece giving it a shot, because why not? Saving money, right cupcake. Oh. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Welcome back. You're in size, it's cold outside. All right, let's let this stuff dry. Whew. Well, the paint stripper works. So, I mean, it's a big pain, but it works. It is coming off. I've already done one peel of it and soap and water does the trick. So let me just do this for forever. Well, I officially hate taking paint off of things more than I do sanding. <laughs> All right, this is as good as I'm gonna get it because I'm over it. I'm gonna spray paint. Here's the true test. They say you should always score when you paint around the tape. I see why now. Okay, let me go get my scoring tool. This, however, is unfortunate. Oh no, look at that, it comes off. I'm going to be painting all the rest of this so it's not bothering me that I've messed up so bad on lots of things. I was sloppy because I knew I was going to be painting over all of this. Let's try that. Yeah, same. I just need to paint around it with a paintbrush and that's it. For what it's worth, I am totally happy with the outcome. It saved me money. And all I have to do is just paint around it, which I'm gonna do a little bit later on. I'm gonna touch up spray paint this too. Listen, I love this. I had one of these growing up. I've tried lots of things. I just really like this one. So I refuse to get rid of it, cause it ain't broke. You can just paint it. And you know what I'm liking about this hammered look? It hides imperfections. I love that. I gotta touch that stuff up. Easy. Okay, let's be real, some mistakes for me. Lots of them learning when to paint, when not to paint. Shouldn't have painted that first because so much stuff has happened and things need to be fixed around it. So, made some mistakes. Learning, living, learning, moving on. But this I cannot, cannot move on from. I gotta fix this. So I'm gonna try to respray it again. Then I came over here and I had never really finished. So I'm gonna do that too. And then I'm gonna put this in there, which I know I should do afterwards but I'm ready to move back into my bathroom. All my things are here. All my things are here. I don't know where half of it is. I can't find a nail clipper to save my life. Drive me crazy. Okay, look, if this doesn't work, I'm just gonna paint over the whole thing. Straight up, like a tattoo. Or put some paint remover on it. Try it again. Probably the quicker solution. This stuff wins. Look at that. It comes off so easy. I am going to take this off, spray it again, do it right this time. <laughs> this time. 
time. Oh my gosh, like I never touched it. And it only took me a few heart palpitations since my arm's about to fall off. Y'all ever seen Lady of the Lake? That's me right now on the right arm. Ugh. Try the mess up next time, Strider. Okay, let's tape it up again. Oh, oh my goodness, I got so much done today, but I'm so tired. Okay, I mopped the walls. <laughs> I mopped the walls. It was so dirty. I had to mop my bathroom too. Like my little tiny toilet, I mopped it. Like the walls. And then I went in here, we did those. We needed the puck lights because we were afraid that the electricity was gonna go out. Oh, ladies, you're beautiful. Anyway, so nice and clean. I finished that, look how pretty it is. That came out amazing. I'm going to learn how to splatter, platter. What's it called? Plaster? Mm. I also need to platter there. <laughs> and then look, I got this thing in. It looks so cool. Y'all like how I just don't care anymore. I'm like, holy man. I just like, you know what? Just spray it. It's all gonna change anyway. So the cool thing is since I did it again, like it worked. It's great. No boo-boos, no nothing. I am now going to pull it off. I decided to add a little section. I think that would look super cool. So let's see what it looks like. I'm really excited about it. Okay, I mopped it too, obviously. Oh, I'm excited. This was the extras to spare the rest of it. Oh, okay, this is just the glue. Did I do a good job of not getting it on everything? If I did, you can't even tell. Oh, yeah. So it is picking up some of the paint. That's okay. I have to, you know, do touch-ups at the end of all of this anyway. No big deal. All in a budget, right? Who cares? We sell this house. We have to redo this whole bathroom. So I'm worried about the black. <laughs> hey, it did good. Ah! Okay, let's look at this now. Was it a good one? Yes. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. I should have done like two and three, but whatever next time. Turns out you could totally take it off. And my question, is it boobs level? Okay, we're good. I'm so tired of this bathroom that I eyeballed it. And I think I eyeballed it well. Whoops. These come off easy, I found. Let me see this. Okay. No, that was good. Last row. Yes. That comes off apparently. Yes, 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 yes. Let's take a look. Do we like it? We do. I'm totally, later in life, gonna keep going up one inch, one inch, one inch, one inch, one inch, one inch. I think it would look super cute. Super cute, just keep going up. All it is is the thick tape. You know, I'm gonna do that before this project's over, I love it. All right, that's it for today. Let's come back tomorrow.